Well, first of all, I'm going to see if I can brew a bunch of potions in in terms of bombs. And it looks like it's <laughs> it's not going to happen. No way that's happening. Alchemy ingredient Tamil Fords. That's that's. Let's go and see if I can have them from uh, this persona. Hey Show me what you got. Let me have a look. Now, now. It looks like he does have a few. And so I can finally buy myself or make myself a bomb. But it looks like it's not gonna work out. So something else, obviously, was missing too. Now, look at that northern wind. We could probably go with that too. You know what I'm gonna do? Show me what you got. Let me have a look. And, um, uh, no, I just kind of decided to buy everything he has. I wonder if I can do this any, any quicker. But, um, it looks like it can be done any quicker. This may take a sec. But look at that, around Fiend Blood. So, the thing is that these items, they spawn back. I think it's good to have at least one of each because eventually it um, will require a mission or a potion or whatever for me to have this. Look at that. What's that? Foglet teeth. Well, that's interesting indeed. I wonder if all of these actually kind of... Um, work out in the end. I mean, do they all end up being used? Finally. Only a few left. As you can see, I'm trying to buy all of them. My money is just incredibly high. So, that's all right, obviously. Now, let's see if I can get myself all those bombs. So, Dancing Star Bomb, that's exactly what I would need. And so I have it. More of these can be made. A Gen Devil Buff Ball. Dimerity Bomb. Dragon Stream Moon Dust contains silver splinters that temporarily prevent monsters from transforming. Well, it could be useful. And um, what else do we have here? Devils, Puffball, Northern Wind freezes foes. Not for long, but probably for long enough. If you wish to escape. And so all of my bombs. So long. Have been dealt with. Now what I would like to equip myself. Is probably. A northern bend. Affects 8 seconds. Freezes foes. And. Um, that's poison damage. That's fire damage. Dragon's dream. Someone blinds opponents with his explosive radius, destroys monster nests. That's good. That's a good thing to have. And so now I'm sure we can move forward. Thanks a lot. I spent a lot of alchemy ingredients on these things. And uh, hopefully they're going to work out just fine for me. Now let's move on with the mission and try... To find out more about the soldiers' movements. But before that, I need to see if um, 
I can throw these. No, no. Northern wind. Would you look at that? Not bad, is it? Okay. Too late to surrender. That's exactly what it should be like. But there's so many of them. Look at that. 48. Level 48. I can't believe that. Oh no, that's the wrong side, you fool. Okay. That should burn them all to pieces. Whoa. And here I am. Maybe Redanian soldiers. Well, just simply a high enough level. But they obviously can fight so much better. Wow, that was a good fight. Good fight indeed. Other soldiers took no notice of that. And so... Use your Witcher senses to eavesdrop on Redanian soldiers patrolling Oxenford to find out where to find... What do you have to say? Uh-huh. You are too close to East. What do you have to say? So let's what listen. Corporal Vatslav. How'd that prick wind up with us? Volunteered. Word is he had to bribe the medics to let him enlist. He mad or what? That's just it. Certifiably insane. Didn't pass the tests apparently. But to pay hard coin to enter the army? Thought at my age nothing could surprise me. Nothing about the cook. Well, obviously, if he had no other way to make money, paying to get into the army wasn't so bad. Hey. What do you have to say? That uh, horse for Sylvie. You got a daughter? Why do you ask? Well, think on it. To marry into a dynasty like that, it'd be like living in Clover. Trust me. You do better not to take any interest in the Basodis. Why the hell not? It can only bring trouble, mate. Only trouble. Hmm. Nothing interesting. Nothing interesting, but we're only listening this for just a few seconds. What do you have to say? Mm, fish chowder for supper the day. That true? Who told you? No one. It looks like they know something. No one. Came through the western gate the morn. Saw Martin on the pier, rod in hand, fishing. Cook like that's the right treasure he is. No griping about poor supplies. Just the gumption to enrich our gruel. Nah, aye. If only he'd... Nah, aye. If only he'd go a bit lighter on the garlic. Pier near the western gate. Should be easy enough to find. Then let's move on. Looks like I was heading to the wrong direction there. Oh. This video game is so beautiful. So, so beautiful. You know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking about a video game just like that with the same graphics, but a war game. Imagine a war game where you're actually at war. That is the only purpose of this game is to fight, is to fight battles against other nations and lead armies and uh, go into this like... Uh, imagine it is a, as a... maybe... What's that? Leave her alone. Why's that? Want us to plow you? Is that it? Doable, but you'll have to hide that mug in a sec. Let her go first. No. Piss off before I kick your asses. I want to kill him. We'll see who kicks whose ass. Get him, lads! Pound his gob! Oh, whoa. It looks like we are going to fight. Whoa. Bam, bam. You fools. 
You all right? Fine. Truth be told, I'd have managed on my own. But thank you. Mm, you could have managed it. You'd have managed it? Managed those men by yourself? Of course. Knee to the bollocks, elbow to the throat. Job done. Let me walk you walk home. Walk you home? Hey now. I'm grateful, sure. But I'll not demonstrate that in the alcove. Walk you home, that's it. Hmm. In that case, yes. Come. And hopefully have sex with you. Rough escort the woman to her home. Let's go. Master Let's... Witcher, do you always help folk for free? Sometimes for free, usually for pay. Phew. I was afraid you were abnormal. That's a very nice Here place. It is. Really, you needn't have troubled yourself. Um, forgot you could have handled it yourself. <clears throat> mm, forgot. Could have managed it on your own. Well, don't let me get in your way. Farewell. She's young, really young. I like that. Recruit the rest of the crew and prepare for the robbery. And so that's exactly what we're doing right now. Visit the garrison cook during the day and convince him to help you. Okay. Well, let's go to the garrison cook then. She did live in a very nice place and that's her place. As you can see, she was rich. And so it's absolutely... Not um, strange that she was being robbed. So that's daytime, and uh, it seems that we'll just have to wait for uh, maybe midday. Look at that. Can't believe it. He's fishing. For, for the soldiers, probably. Good day. Fish biting? Aye, they're biting. What about you? What's that? Got this mixture. Pay you to pour it in the soup for the boys of the garrison, on my signal. Nothing dangerous about it. Most they'll think is that the fish wasn't exactly fresh. It'll cost you, mate. Something dear. Fine. I'm willing to pay. I'll give him the money. Here. Wait for the signal. And mum's the word. Understood? Look at that, Patso. Dog hand. Very healthy indeed. And uh, so now, as you can see, my level is only th 35, which isn't that much. Let's go here and see what else I can have for myself. And so, combat. Core ability. This is one of the core abilities. It's always active. Wolf school defensive techniques. Arrow deflection. Deflect arrows while parrying. Acquire this ability. What else? Damage from hits received while dodging is reduced by 20. After a successful counterattack, the next attack deals 30% more damage. That's good. Would you look at that? After a successful counter-attack, the next attack deals 30% damage per skill level and is critical hit with a chance of knockdown based on the number of adrenaline points. Each adrenaline point adds 1% to the chance of killing an opponent instantly. And uh, so we'll, we'll, we'll surely build on this. As you can see, I have 102 points, so it's probably best if I... Just purchase whatever I can. 
because um, I can allow increases crossbow critical hit chance. Let's have this. <clears throat> Increases it by 25. Critical hits dealt with the crossbow disabled monster special abilities for 5 seconds. And now it's for 25 seconds. Adrenaline points loss upon taking damage is lowered by 20%. When vitality reaches 0, adrenaline points will immediately be consumed to restore it. Instantly gain one adrenaline point when entering combat. The adrenaline points generated by sword blows are increased by 5%. When casting a sign, three adrenaline points, if available, will be consumed to upgrade the sign to the highest level, unlocking all bonuses and increase sign intensity by 25%. Okay. More crossbow and some of these. More of that. It looks it looks fine now. Now would you look at that? So far things are going just fine on this side there. Besides, there's something I can add here, obviously. Uh, okay, instantly gain. I've seen some good good stuff there. Let's see what do I have here. Maximum inventory rate increase. I don't really need that. Not now. And uh, I just simply need some good, good stuff. First attack damage is increased by 25%. Increases the chance of landing a fast attack. Let's go with that. Then spinning attack that strikes while foes in surrounding area, maintaining the attack consumes stamina and adrenaline. Let's go with that. Fast attacks now also apply a bleeding effect. Can go without it. Strong attack damages increase by 25%. Increase strong attack. So that's a strong attack, which is great, obviously. We have some alchemy, some general stuff. And uh, you ignore bomb and special bolt effects, increases maximum toxicity. Nothing, nothing too interesting so far. Attack power. Yeah, that's exactly what I would need. Some attack power. Obviously, that is very, very important. And um, so I shall increase my attack powers a little bit more. Now things should go my way even further. Let's uh, move forward now. And um, see what we can do. It's time to prepare ourselves for uh, the robbery. Would you look at this garden right there? Where exactly I need to go? It's probably just need to enter this hut from this side. Look at this ditch. Can't believe this tree worked out so well. <laughs> Grew in a in a hole. Hey there. It doesn't look like he's so gonna long. tell me anything. So, I'm just gonna go down instantaneously, just fall, BAM! He can fall and roll at the same time. And mighty must be midst the unattached. I am. The only for a wee spell now. Is that so? Impossible. Only a fool would loosen their hold on a mate like you. Ah, at last, we're all here. Time to begin. This heist. It's no jest. So if any of you has any doubts, isn't sure, now's the time to leave. Won't be able to after. The Borsodi's auction house, it's vault. That's our target. 
Eveline, you will enter through the tower when the patrol rounds this corner. Drop us a line. We have to be inside within five minutes, is that enough? It's plenty. Splendid. Once we're all in the tower, we'll proceed to the auction house. Shouldn't see any guards inside. If we do, we'll have Geralt and his blades. Then, downstairs to the vault. Casimir blows the vault door. We go in, take the loot, disappear out the back through a secret passage. I've said my piece. Any questions? No plan B. Any security measures inside? Secret passage, why not get in that way? Got a horse sense take on this. Secret passage. If we plan to use it on the way out, why not on the way in? Excellent question. Why not? Every corridor has two ends, right? Like a rope. I know the location of just one end. It's in the vault. The other, it's somewhere beneath the city. But I can't tell you where. Mm-hmm. Great. Aye, but you could... Find that location. I wouldn't need any of you. Believe you me, I've tried. Time and again. Anything else? Let's go to work. All right, let's get to work. Want to be done with this as soon as possible. We'll reconvene in the gateway beside the tower. Midnight sharp. And everyone's to make sure they're not followed. I'll get word to the cook in the barracks. What about masks? Got a rather recognizable mug myself. I'll tend to that. Ah, one last thing. Inform the City Watch. Blabber anything about this over a nail. And I'll kill you. With me own hands. I don't even know if that accent was British. I say we go there together now. If you're so damn scared, somebody will talk. Let's go right there now. together. Now. Any objections? Anyone need more time? On our way then. So I finished the conversation. Prime. Just one patrol. Mixture of yours must have worked. Eveline, you ready? Are you kidding? Of course I am. Three, two, one. On your way. Plowing city foul. Shite all over again. What? Oh, so. Patrol's turning round. Move! Damn. Should have blown myself a bit. Prick and all. You said there'd be no one inside. Seems my informer was wrong. Is that all you've got to say? I nearly broke my neck. You knew what you were signing up for. This is no time to argue. Gotta agree. Backing out's not an option anymore. Need to see this through, whatever happens. Hallowed words. One guard could mean many more. You'd best draw your sword now. No. What now? 
No one dies. Said so from the start. And so we'll fight with wooden swords then. It is Whatever. unclear why. Don your masks and let's go. Let's move then and uh, go to the vault in the auction house basement. I wonder if I can steal stuff along Clear the for way. now. Knock on wood. Good. I didn't knock your heads, everyone. Mine are open. I've only seen several things I would gladly take with me. Not now. Yes, but we shall raise the starting. Pr Watch this. Guards! Guards! Well, that's that. We're buggered. You said. I damn well know what I said. At them before they sound the alarm. Okay, let's fight. Your mum yeah. smells a good breeze! They're tough. Don't know how they. How they didn't find this. Looks like somebody's dead. After all. Stop him! He's not to flee! That was a clear alarm. Lock themselves in. Bollocks! Damn it. Lay down your arms! You have no chance! Perhaps not. <laughs> but we do have hostages. Mercy, master! On the count of three, we go in! One! Two! Come one step closer and folk will die! Hold now! We must negotiate. What are your demands? To release the hostages? Buy us a bit of time, Geralt. Pull back from the auction house. We have one demand. Pull back from the auction house. You know I cannot do that! You can, just not sure you want to. How about I help you decide, kill a hostage? Just do what they want! I beg you! <laughs> Calm yourself! No one is to be harmed, clear? Nothing simpler. So long as you take your boys and pull out, we'll all live happily ever after. I repeat, that is not an option. We must bargain, reach an agreement. Tell me, Jeff, bring us a wagon and horses. So we want a wagon and horses. It's the middle of the night. Where am I to find a wagon? Rather go looking for caskets. <laughs> he means it! Good point. A wagon then? What kind? Carriage that carried Rodovit to his carnation. Doesn't matter. We're not picky. Any old cart, long as it has wheels that roll. All right, I'll get it done. In exchange, you must release the hostages. How many? All of them. What was that? It looks like somebody threw a bomb in here. Whoa. They were not fooling around. What if I would uh, equip myself with another sword? But it seems that there are no swords for me to equip, unfortunately. Damn, 
And so, we'll just have to fight it the way it is. Need to get behind him. Now, finally, we can beat him up. Done. Damn it, explosion triggered that fight. Could have done without both. That explosion gets us in the vault. Where's Eveline? She's fled. All the better. Fewer hands reaching out for loot. Come on before reinforcements arrive. Let's go then. The vault. Would you look at that. A request for payment. Anything else out there? You know, it's um a good time to check things out. At the same time, nobody should be coming here. And look at that, another one. Probably another list of objects in need of restoration. Very interesting. And it should be it, I suspect. But obviously, we have to check the tables. And would you look at that? One more. A letter from Master Matthew. And it seems that we read it. Done. I'm sure that was all. All of those tables that can be checked out and something found on them. He blew the door. It was a wooden door, wooden reinforced. A mighty fine whoop that was! A wee bit loud, aye, on account I had to add more fulminating silver than usual, but I I'm not interested. No one's interested. We go in. Geralt, you're at the fore. Why me? It's why I hired you. Now move, with no time. Okay, let's go. Search the wall for Maximilian's house. And so we are finally in the wall. Let's first of all check this out. Mm, not a special... Oh, wait, wait a second. Where did we went in? You don't know who you're fucking with. That was another. On the contrary, I know all too well. Section. You. You old? Greetings, brother. Been years. Stone me stupid and slap me happy! Should have known. You own. You owe us an explanation. Elvis board Sodi. <clears throat> Think you owe us an explanation, you old Borsodi. <clears throat> this family reunion. What's the point? Revenge. For betrayal. Years of poverty. Humiliation. Father left the auction house to me in his will. Horst cheated me. Had me disinherited. Anything. Everything we <clears throat> earned, you squandered on cards and whores. Father didn't see that. I did. That's no excuse, Horst. Save your life. You two, stand with me. I'll not let the Redanians lay a hand on you. Give you whatever you want. Tempting offer, Horst. I'm in. I'm with you. Can't bribe me. I stick with Ewald. Not about to meddle in your grooming matters. Uh, you know what? <clears throat> I'm going to stay with Ewald this time. A desperate attempt at bribery going once, twice, thrice. Hmm. No takers, no sale. Oh, we'll take whatever we please. Once we've ripped your runners from your ass! Hallowed words, mate. Adam! <clears throat> exactly. Die. There's a lot of gold there. 
I'd have preferred to resolve this elsewise. Stolen the scrolls, thrown you out into the street. Revenge is best served cold, after all. But I don't mind serving it hot. No. I beg you, mercy for your brother. I shall do anything you ask. Truly. Anything. Anything. Sign over to me all that you own. Then walk out as you stand with just the clothing on your back. Allow me one thing, any one thing. Ah, he's smart. Fifteen years. In the sewers. Bent. Like a beast. And you the cheek. To plead. Awesome. Take that! Well, well. Satisfied? Exceptionally! You? No. And I won't be until I find Max Bersotti's house. In this vault, or so you said. And it is. There. But I fear it's not yours for the taking. You see, it houses my father's will. A scroll thanks to which Ewald Borsodi, long missing, will assume the family fortune. And Geralt of Rivia, who you cheated, what'll he assume? Alas, but he's free to choose anything else. Gents. Gents, keep calm. Don't provoke me. Never know. Might choose to take your head. You're wounded. Tired. Figure my chances are good. Dumb decision, but have it your way. Hmm. Dumb, but have it your way. Let's make this quick before the soldiers get down here. At your service, mate. Casimir. Stand with me. I'll make you my treasurer. Your salary in the thousands, mate. Sorry, Geralt. Coin's coin. No two ways about it. Okay. It wasn't... Wasn't that bad after all. Done. Let's see what they got. Nothing really. Look at all this going right there. Yeah, that's so much gold. I would never have to be a witcher ever again. The only mission I had to do is to just come here and loot whatever I want. And that's exactly what I'm going to do now. I'm going to loot all of this stuff whatever it is and um, that will make me feel rich most of this stuff is probably made out of gold anyway and most of it at least sounds truly truly precious Okay, where else I can find more gold? Look at that. All of these crates, it looks like they were full. Besides that, I need to go to that other room. Uh, see if I can have any of this. You cannot do that now. What if I use R? No, 
No. Surrender. You don't stand a chance. It looks like um, it wouldn't have worked out anyway. Because the soldiers would know that we were the robbers. And so finally we're taking it. Damn candles. We have fun. Danians will be here soon. Damn it. Secret passage. Where is it? Find the secret way out of there. Okay, finally found it. And um <sighs> Air seeping through the cracks. Passage must be here. Now how do I open it? I have no idea. There's probably a lever. A lever somewhere. Nothing else. Seems to make sense. I definitely won't crack this. And um, the only thing I'm left with is just just looking around and trying to find this lever or a button. Look at that sword in it. That's a massive sword if you think about it. It seems we'll have to go to this other one. And look, you know, in the best case scenario, same paintings were on the block. Okay, same paintings were on the block. Same paintings were on the block. I kind of suspect that, um, battery ram, run and get a ram. Look at those soldiers there. I could easily wipe them out. Redenia! And run away. Look for the spare key. Nothing so far. Battery ram! Run and get it! My richer senses do not feel. Any kind of um, indication. That would help me with the door. And finally we got it. We probably need to push this. And it's not doing it. Nick of time. Now to get out of here. Okay. Exactly. And this place, hmm, <clears throat> it isn't so bad after all. Not that abandoned as I thought. Obviously, it was specifically made for escaping. And so now we can get out. I wonder if the owners of this place have any idea of this secret passage and so where it is, it was right there. Right there. Take Maximilian Borsod's house to Oldbeard. So we finally done all this work. Just so that we could bring Long live one box with a bill in it to some guy. But this is what we do, right? Long live, brother. Not just any guy, actually, any mortal one. How much for a heavy? <laughs> Need to chat. I'm all ears with you. 
got Barsad's house for you. Got something for you. I love gifts, but I prefer to unwrap them in private. Oi, lads, mind the barrels. Going out for a jabber with Geralt. Come. Oh, that's better. All right, what do you have for me? Max Persodi's house, as requested. Ah, Horst must be livid. He's not. No? He's not anything except dead. His brother, same thing. A few others, too. Stones you've got. But I didn't think you'd have the stomach for a massacre. Hey, you underestimated me. Oh, think I might find the stomach for another, once your final wish is fulfilled. <laughs> you really don't like me, do you? Hate smartasses. Hate it when they try to use me. It's why both brothers are dead, and why you should tread carefully. Noted. Now I have some advice for you. The Borsodis aren't worth your tears. Sons of bitches to a man. <laughs> Why do you need those papers? Why did you need those papers? To sink the Borsodis, naturally. You see, I learned of an interesting clause in old man Maximilian's will. It states that his sons must meet and shake hands in agreement at least once a year at Bellatain. Failing that, the auction house must be auctioned off. The proceeds to go to Vilmeria's hospital. Guess the old man sensed what might happen. Horst and Yuld are gnawing on soil now. But thanks to these papers, their relatives won't get the auction house. Family's lost it for good. And the hospital will have the funds it needs to treat orphans and beggars pro bono. Awfully noble of you, showing so much concern for the needy. I couldn't give a rat's ass about the needy. May they wither and disappear along with the city. I wanted one thing. Revenge. And so you have it. The Borsodis. What's your gripe? Get kicked out of an auction? Worse. They evicted me from my home. Are you really interested? Uh, no, no. Oh, yeah. Wouldn't have asked if I wasn't. Ha! <laughs> Cheeky as ever. My family. They took on some debt. A poor investment in a sawmill. A bad crop one year. A lawsuit lost. You know how it is. When it rains, it pours. We needed but a few weeks to recover. But Horst Borsodi had acquired our debt. All of it. Demanded it be repaid immediately. I pleaded. I begged. I tore open my shirt at his threshold. Ugh. It was like talking to a wall. I went to the auction. Saw those perfumed pricks by my father's sword. My mother's death mask. My brother's horse tack. Ah, Horst earned a pretty pile selling our mementos. No surprise the animosity you feel for him. That was but the start. My Iris's parents learned of my family's misfortune. And our betrothal was no more. They found her another suitor. One from beyond the sea. The anger I felt. I thought I'd gone mad. Went to the tavern, drank around, a second, a brawled, then had another tankard. And then, then, I asked the wrong bloke for help. What happened then? What happened then? Ah, what happened then, Witcher, was one big stinking pile of shite. Doesn't sound good. Well, why do you stand there? Do you need something still? No, not really. Third task, tell me about it. Third wish. Time you stated it. A moment, forget I will say to something. Then we'll chat. You there. Yank the heron out the barrel.
Come on, none of this dallying. Ah, ah, ah. What is he is all about? Now, ready to listen? Or do you still not give two shites about what I've got to say? I'm ready. I'm listening. Good. You'll return to your lord and tell him as follows. His demand was brazen. Hurt me to the core. For I was brought up to respect the sacred law of hospitality. And I shall not bend to an uncouth boar's dictum. Understood. I will pay him a visit shortly to test his willingness to adapt. So you ride off and announce me. And don't spare your horse. Got it? Aye, got it. Give this man a mount and leave him go. I'll come with you. We must talk outside. Their theory believe one should only discuss important matters out of doors with the gods as witnesses. Why were you keeping that man in a barrel? Barrel? What was that about? On the way here, we stopped for nourishment at a tavern belonging to one Lord Dauntless. We enjoyed ourselves as one does at an inn, raucously. Our antics were not to the liking of this Dauntless. Sent a man to warn us that if we were ever to return, we would hang. You burned the inn down? I left ample compensation with the innkeeper. But it seems the rapscallion neglected to mention this to his lord. But that's of little import. What matters is someone called me a horse and threatened to kill me. It was one of those threats that sound like an invitation. I intend to accept it. Return to those parts. You'll get what's coming to you one day. Must have made quite a few enemies along the way. Maybe not today and not tomorrow, but someday, someone will find a way to take you down. And that should trouble me why. I feel no fear, no regret. The wise men of Oxenfurt claim there are no gods. After death, there is only the void. I've known this void already. Death holds no surprises. Third task. Let's talk about it. Fulfilled two of your wishes. Time I learned the third. Confident, aren't you? Proud, sure of your strengths. Fearless. Third task, if you don't mind. Mutations. They stripped you of emotion. Tell me, have you ever loved? I mean, truly loved? Your third wish, now. In no mood for a heart to heart. I'm to do something for you. Tell me what it is. A true professional, eh? Know what I think? I think you only feign the cold killer. When in fact you seek new and ever stronger sensations. As I do. Seek to prove to yourself that you are still able to feel. That some remnant of humanity remains within you. I'd make a right good witcher. Problem is, I don't know the road to Kaer Morhen. And I doubt you'd give me a pendant. Cut the shit, Ogird. Third wish, still waiting to hear it. Why, aren't you stubborn? Fine. Listen well. I had a wife once. The day I saw her last, I gave her a rose. A violet one. Bring me that blue. Wouldn't mind reminding myself what it looks like. <sighs> when was that? How long's it been? Flowers wilted and turned to dust by now. You wished to hear a wish. Now you have. Fulfill it. I ride now to visit this Dauntless. But one of my men will remain here. He'll know how to find me. That is, of course, should you succeed. At least you can tell me where your wife is. In my old manor, east of Martin Foy's farmstead. I'd wish you Godspeed, but, well, you understand, I'm sure. Goodbye, Geralt. Okay. And so I'll be traveling there now. Go to the Everick Manor.
that looks like a like a proper castle to me not a castle but you know a big mansion somewhere I would like to live as a witcher somebody like me could make that money but you look at those clothes that he is currently wearing I really 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 like these I think that um, it worked out Anyone quite well. There? Mighty rusty and covered in creepers. Kendrick! Kendrick! You there? Not so loud. Ah! God, scared me off to- Not so loud, I said. Fog's not natural. Could be something in there hiding. Foglets or air nymphs, for example. Don't want to attract them. Believe me. F foglets Oh, sweet mother Malitary, why don't I ever come here? Good question. What are you doing here? Good question. What are you doing here? See, Kendrick and me, we thought man has been empty all these years full of fine things going to rot. Mm hmm. So you're a thief. Thief steal from the living. What's the arm taking from the dead? Kendrick went to open the door. I stood watch. Suddenly heard his lamp smash. Then nothing. Quiet. Called out to him, but... So let's find out. Whoa. What? What, what was that? Here's that sound. One of them foglets you spoke of. No. I like it. Phew. That's the stone off my... I'll see what that was and look for your partner. You... I ain't about to wait around. I'm out of here. Pretty sprawling, this estate. And so search for I the partner. find that rose in this fog. Of the thief you met, use a witch's senses to search the grounds of one ever accustomed day for a violet rose. Fresh manure. Also, I'm sure I'm going to find both. Rather worn, used often. Wonder by who. Okay, maybe it was just there forever. Water's ice cold, mountain stream cold. Well, we already saw that there is definitely somebody's out there. Let's move forward. Maybe we'll find somebody. Woods rotted completely. Well, that means nobody's using it. Beehives, well maintained but dormant. No violet rose here. Maybe somewhere out back. Maybe it is. I should probably run around now. There's still one spot. A black cat. I hate black cats. I just hate. Let's scooch along, kitty. This place. What's that? That. Digging. Walking through black cats. Bath. Bath. A lockpick? Must have been the other thieves. Prints from cleated boots, leading from the back of the garden. It looks like I'm going to find that guy. Someone dragged a wounded man through here. And hopefully we'll find the beast that was making that sound. He's there, so interesting. Graves, unmarked, laid out in rows like garden beds. <clears throat> they are probably just 
Burying hey. whoever enters there. Hear me? You fool. Look at me. Another thief. Bodies mutilated. Who are you? That sound is incredible. It looks like it's not human. Beast? Caretaker. How you like frost, caretaker? Oh, you like it. You like it very much. or nostrils, deformed organs, damn thing had no right to be alive. And then there's you, and you left the game. Well, philosophers do still debate what it means to be alive, exactly. Normally I'd be shocked, exactly. but not after what I just saw. Who are you two? Clearly not animals. Think of us as friends of the house. Ha. Huh. You two are a little mysterious. What's with the show? The pretense that you're animals. You couldn't have warned me? No. We're obliged to maintain discretion. So why talk to me at all? Why? Well, we get so few chances to talk to humans, and we're curious to know what brought you. Gonna need a better answer than that. Later. Well, that was nice. The creature, what was it? What about this thing? What can you tell me? Friend of yours? We called him the caretaker. Doesn't look like any creature I've ever seen. Where'd it come from? From very far away. He was summoned to guard Lady Iris in the home. He tended the garden, took care of unwanted guests. Very far away? Meaning where exactly? The name of this place would mean naught to you. Looking for a while at Rose. You know the master of the house, the owner? Olgit von Everick? Yes, we know him, but he left, and his wife became mistress of the house. Great. So, Lady von Everick home? Could you announce me, say she has a guest? Why do you wish to see her? I'm here to get the violet rose Olgit gave Iris just before he left. Iris is inside, in the bedchamber upstairs. Take his key. It opens the rear door. Guess I'll make my own introductions. It's... So, how should I address you? As you did now. We'd rather keep our names to ourselves. First of all, I'm gonna loot the beast. The caretaker's spade. A relic. Good enough. I truly enjoy that. I think that was an awesome creature that uh, was truly amazingly wise. Be gone! You are not my liege. Somebody speaking here. I hate when they, somebody is speaking to me like that. Now we are going to go the hell 
out of there into another room and I already saw something on the table that we have to pick up not the first wraith I've dealt with. One thing's for sure. Let's do this. Iris is sketching. What the hell was that? Let's ignite this. And uh, a light of the fire. She came out from the painting. And uh, it seems that it's just some kind of a ghost. That um, intruder is out there. Damn, it's giving me the creeps, but I like it. I like it a lot. Let's move um, up. It looks like the wood is still okay. It looks like the beast or the wraith is not going to hurt me. Search the Iris von Everick on the upper floor. Happy families are all alike. Every unhappy family is unhappy in its own way. It seems that this is the guy that um, has asked us to work things out for him. I can already hear the mm, breathing. Fire damage. Interesting. Okay. You can read that. It was a book I didn't have. What else is out there? Anything? Nothing that I can see. However, I can hear her breathe. Nothing seems to be of uh, importance there and uh, so let's try to move forward the door is locked I'm still looking for something on the upper floor but um, I suspect that everything in here is locked now so is there an upper floor besides that? I don't know. Maybe there's another part of the house that can be entered somehow. I'm just gonna back here and go back just to check once again if there is any kind of indication of anything. And so far I haven't seen it. Would you look at that? There's something outside that would require investigation. So I'm gonna go and uh, check this out. Rope looks new. Bucket's been repaired. Okay, there was something. Carter's else. hut. Could it be? Tools are so organized, it's scary. So this is where the caretaker lived, most likely. That has something to do with the caretaker. And uh, not the woman. Okay. It seems that the only way I can enter this house is from the same side as previously. Done. And so once again I have to carefully investigate this and look for clues that um, will tell me more about um, 
iris and she should should tell me where that rose is let's loot these places here okay I've, I've seen something out here and it's on a table it looks like a dinner table hmm, tidy and everything's clean ready for a meal to be served caretaker must still set the table I bet he is anything I see something there another painting that requires investigating all geared as I've never known him a different man then well he probably didn't change much anyway all geared as I've never known him a different man then probably anything else I'm gonna just investigate this a little bit further because on the upper floor as you already know I haven't found anything whatsoever unless I have to go to the upper floor from another side but it seems it's certainly not this side then uh, we shall move along this there won't help me out dude the door is locked and so on the upper floor the last time I found nothing she came out of the painting as always which isn't surprising at all let's see if art can help us a little bit <coughs> and <clears throat> and it seems that it won't the door is locked I found no keys the house is obviously haunted. Happy families are all alike. Every unhappy family is unhappy in its own way. We already been there. More paintings. Nobody has uh, stole any of these paintings though. I don't see any more indications on the walls. And so I'm gonna go out. outside but the, the door to go outside is locked too and so it seems that I'm uh, a little stuck here however maybe maybe I just needed to go to the second room would you look at that the door opened on its own other doors are locked at least we know we're heading to the right direction seems that um, we ended up whoa look at that so yes yes sucker. We did it quite well. What was that? Obviously, that was her. The chamber. I was supposed to be here. That's her. We already fought her. Gotta be her. Damn it. She got so old and so ugly. You wish to see her? Here she is. A man should frame his wishes carefully. It forestalls disappointment. This some sick joke. Why didn't you tell me she was dead right away? You didn't ask. <sighs> and why hasn't anyone buried her? We can't. As for the caretaker, the one you cut down, while still alive, she ordered him to stay away from her for all time. Okay, how did she die? How did she die? Don't see any wounds, evidence of a fight. Her heart burst. Meaning what? A heart attack? No, it simply burst. 
find that hard to believe. Yet that's precisely what happened. One day Iris locked the front door, lay down here and died. From grief, from loneliness. Why are you helping me? The deeper I get into this, the more I gotta wonder. Why are you even helping me? We were summoned to serve Iris von Everick. Our mistress died, but that did not free us from her service. Got it. You want to leave this place, leave these bodies. <laughs> Surprised. No, not at all. Iris Roth. What was it born of? Her ghost's restless, angry, attacks intruders. Know why? Lady Von Everick has endured much hardship. She's unaccustomed to guests and not fond of strange folk. She can't hear us. Need to talk to Iris' ghost. Seems I gotta speak to Iris' ghost. It's no easy task to contact the mistress. Rage and bitterness fill her. Got my ways. To make contact with Iris, I gotta bury her body. But that caretaker's macabre little cemetery won't do. Too much blood, too much fear. She spent much time in the front garden. Hmm. Maybe there. Wait. Take this key. It opens the front door. Good dog. Good dog indeed. Find a fish.